Traditions go a long way in defining the season, and an event that happens in Brookings before Christmas every year brings law enforcement and kids along with their families together for a night of shopping and fun. Kellyanne's Carter Schmidt tells you about what they have planned this year. Christmas Kids and Cops started in Brookings about 20 years ago. Brookings Police Department Assistant Chief Joe Fischbacher used to be a school resource officer, and the original idea for this event came from him and another officer during his time in that position. We just saw a need um, with the kids in the schools we worked with. Um, they, 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 were, they had a need, um, uh, whether it be food or clothes or, or something. Um, so we kind of took this process and evolved it, and it started out with oh, about eight kids way back when we started it to now we're up to 36. Participating kids are picked by teachers, counselors, and school resource officers. We want a story of what's happening with this family so we know. Um, and that's kind of how the referral comes. Brookings Police Department, Brookings County Sheriff's Office, and Kingsbury County Sheriff's Office are three of the various participating law enforcement agencies every year. It's heartwarming. It really is just to see the joy on the kids' faces and the excitement. Um, Santa's on hand, so they get to see Santa. We provide face painting as well. Everybody has a good time. The event includes up to $300 for each participant to spend while shopping. The kids also receive gift cards. Local businesses and private donors typically raise around twenty to $25,000 to make the event happen. The gift cards that they get allow them to go out to eat at one of the restaurants here in town, a couple of them actually, and they also get gift cards to go to the movie so they can have a night together as a family in addition to the night where they do the shopping. In addition to shopping, each family also goes home with a cart full of groceries. The items kids pick out are wrapped by volunteers. We see kids that sometimes don't even get gifts for themselves. They think of their family and their brothers and sisters and mom and dad, what they would want. We've seen kids buy dog food and microwaves and vacuums and things like that, and they're thinking about their family. In Brookings, Carter Schmidt, Kelland News. The event will happen at the Brookings Walmart this Wednesday. If you would like to make a donation to Christmas, kids and cops, you can send or drop off donations to the Brookings Police Department or Brookings County Sheriff's Office.